many countries are still struggling to contain outbreaks of COVID-19. And adding to that concern is the emergence of a number of coronavirus variants, which health experts say could be more contagious. So what is a variant? It's when a virus develops noticeable mutations which can cause it to behave differently. Right now, the UN's World Health Organization has classified four COVID-19 variants that are worrying. The one that was originally detected in Britain, known formally as B117, the variant discovered in South Africa, officially called B1351, the one uncovered in Brazil, known scientifically as P1. And most recently, a variant which first emerged in India called B1617 that the WHO's lead scientist says helped accelerate a dramatic spike in cases in that country. All four variants share most of the genetic sequence found in the original COVID-19 virus, but each one also has its own unique mutations. Viruses mutate naturally over time when they replicate. And while researchers don't yet know how exactly these variants surfaced, they point to three main possibilities. The first is that the virus becomes stronger as it continuously transmitted from one person to the next. If mutations enabled the virus to infect people more easily or be transmitted more effectively, it is a case of survival of the fittest. Another possibility is human to animal transmission. Cats, tigers and minks are among the types of animals known to be susceptible to the coronavirus that causes COVID-19. Some researchers have argued the virus could have jumped from humans to an animal, mutated in the animal host, and then jumped back to humans. The third possibility is that the virus remained in a chronically ill person for a prolonged period and mutated while inside the host who may not have had sufficient immunity. This might have allowed the virus to develop into a more resistant variant. The British, South African, Brazilian and Indian variants of COVID-19 have been shown to be more contagious or come with more severe symptoms, meaning treatment could be possibly less effective. According to the US Centers for Disease Control and Prevention, the British variant is 50% more harmful. As of now, there isn't data showing that they are more fatal, but researchers say a mutation that is found in at least two of the variants could enable the coronavirus to dodge a vaccine-induced immune response. This would also mean people who've recovered from COVID-19 could be reinfected with the variants. Still, health experts are encouraging everyone, including those who've recovered from COVID-19, to get a vaccine as soon as one becomes available to them. They say vaccines provide a high degree of protection against serious illness or death from COVID-19, and the current vaccines will continue to be improved to better protect against coronavirus variants. Scientists say there aren't any extra precautions to take against the COVID-19 variants. The same general pandemic rules apply. Wear a mask, frequently wash your hands, avoid crowded, poorly ventilated indoor areas and practice social distancing. And when the opportunity becomes available to you, get a COVID-19 vaccine. <laughs>